Hi everybody, this is Connie. Just wanted to let you know if you were interested in hearing an update about my situation. Um, Monday's Last Monday's video was my um, makeup of the day and I did explain everything there. So I, you know, just so it's not repetitive on every single video, um, go on back and look at that one. All right. So if you're interested in any unboxings, stay tuned. Um, I actually had a surprise in the mail yesterday when I went. I didn't go anywhere today, but um, yesterday when I went to the post office, I had a surprise in my mail. I got um, my bookcase.club dot, bookcase dot mail uh, subscription box. And I was rather surprised because I don't know that... It, I didn't think that I had enough money in my account to pay for that last month. So, um, um, anyway, I got a couple of books. And this this is a subscription that comes every month. Um, it is two books. Um, they are different. You can choose your genre. You can choose from, um, like I did, um, I get Paranormal Romance, because that's all I read. I love that kind of stuff. Um, you can choose from contemporary romance. You can choose from young adult. You can choose to get, um, I think it's three books a month, three or four books a month for children, so you can read to your children at night. You can get, um, I think there's a mystery. And I can't remember if there's anything else. Um... It does not say, but it does, here's all the information for the bookcase.club, where you can find them. And John is the owner of bookcase.club, and he is a super, super nice guy. And they have videos um, every once in a while updating things on YouTube. So um, if you'd like, just join their YouTube. Okay, so here's my two books. Um, I got, I actually got a hardcover this month, which is a steampunk romance, which I normally don't read, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if I'm interested in this or not. It is A Conspiracy of Alchemists by Liesl Swartz. And there is the front cover. Tell you what it says about this book. I saw her for what she was, this young woman with the clear blue eyes. I saw that she would cast no shadow on the narrow path between shadow and light, but I also saw that others would want to use her for what she was. The alchemists are strong, but she is stronger. From the moment I saw her, I knew that she would offer salvation, but salvation often comes at a price, and when there is a price to be paid, there's a chance of total ruin. Sounds interesting, doesn't it? In a golden age where spark reactors power the airways and creatures of light and shadow walk openly among us, the deadly game of alchemists and war warlocks has begun. When an unusual cargo drags airship pilot Ellie Chance into the affairs of the mysterious Mr. March, she must confront her destiny and do everything in her power to stop the alchemists from unleashing a magical apocalypse. Discover the thrilling new series that transforms elements of urban fantasy and paranormal romance into pure story storytelling gold. Wonderful. There's a new book coming. It says The Chronicle of Light and Shadow continues, and that will be a clock, clockwork heart. But that is a, um, this was $25, this book, and I got it for two of them for $99.99. Okay, and then look at look at the, the pages on this. I mean, they are the old style pages, which I absolutely love. Okay, so that is the first book. And the second book is by an author that I absolutely adore. Um, I have read her whole um, Mercy. <laughs> now it went out of my head. Anyway, it, this is Patricia, 
Patricia Briggs, and I absolutely love her. Um, this is called Shifter's Wolf, and it's this is her her de debut novel, Masks, and its sequel, Mo Wolf Band, together in one book. Before there was Mercy Thompson, that's the book. Um, in a world far removed from the Alpha and Omega werewolves, there was the shape-shifting mercenary Aralorn. Aralorn? Patricia Briggs always enchants her readers. Masks, that's the first book. After an upbringing of proper behavior and oppressive ex expectations, Aralorn er has fred... Oh my gosh, I can't talk today. I apologize. After an upbringing of proper behavior and oppressive expectations, Aralorn has fled her noble, noble birthright for a life of adventure as a mercenary spy. Her latest mission involves gathering intelligence of the increasing, in, on the increasingly charismatic and dangerous sorcerer Jeffrey A. Maggi, but in a war against the adver, adverse... I am so sorry. <laughs> I cannot read today. But in a war against an adversary armed with the power of illusion, how do you know who is the true enemy, who the true enemy is, or where he will strike next? Wolfsbane is the next book. For the last ten years, Erlorn has led a dangerous existence. Now she must return home for her noble father, the Lloyd Lion of Lamb's Hold, has passed away. But when Erlorn and her companion Wolf arrive, they find that not only is he not dead, but a darkness is very much alive within him. Wow. That looks interesting. I always love the artwork on, on her books, too. But the Mercy Thompson series, oh my gosh, I will talk to you about that at a later date. But um, this has got two books in one. It looks like it was $15. So, both of these books are more than what I paid for this whole thing. So, if you like this kind of thing, uh, please look them up. Bookcase Club Bot... No. Oh my gosh! This is getting ridiculous. Bookcaseclub.net dot com Bookcase dot club there you go. And here is the stuff again. I apologize for that, you guys. <laughs> I will try to get better with that. But I do stumble over my words sometimes. Anyway, if you are at all interested in this kind of stuff, please check out this bookcase.club. And like I said, they are on YouTube. They are on Twitter. They are on Instagram, I believe. So I will talk to you guys soon. Bye-bye.